Welcome to another episode of Leon Smash Burgers Pops In. I'm Leon Catalano and today's episode brings us to the heart of Richmond. I'm turning dreams into reality. In the lab with the formula and chemistry. Your memories spark and motivate and make the industry shake. We put the bars in the place. I'm talking one, yeah. It's one all one shot. Now the future is yours. Go! In this episode of Little Smash Burgers Pops In, this restaurant has established itself as one of Richmond's most well-known food destinations. Today, I pop in to the Beer Burger Bar. Let's go in. Founded by the father and son duo of Gabrielle and Ryan Kerbin in 2013, the bar has continued to grow from strength to strength, specialising in appetising burgers sourced from local ingredients and a vast range of beers and ciders. The Beer and Burger Bar is a great place to be. Their burgers provide really good value for money. They are generous in size and are mostly made with brioche buns. I had the privilege to have a first-hand experience of the Beer and Burger Bar as well as have a chat with the owner and the man himself, Ryan Kerbin. Ryan, what is your inspiration and story behind the beer and burger bar? A friend of my dad's actually owns this premises and he actually approached us and said, hey, I've got a spot on Swan Street, are you interested in coming and having a look? He said, my dad goes, look, let's just go down, we'll just go have a look and just, you know, it's not up for us, it's not for us. Came down, had a look, and it's actually a really good position. And I think the rugby was on that day, so it was heaps of people walking up and down the street. And we thought, oh, what a, what a good opportunity. And after sitting for about half an hour, I said to my dad, I think we should open a burger place because there's nothing really like that around, around here. But what are the most popular items on your menu? Our classic beef is probably our best seller. Anyone comes in and they haven't been before, I'm like, I always direct them straight to that one. That or the cheeseburger, I feel like they're, you know, your the OGs of any burger place. Yeah, yeah. So they're, they're probably our best our best sellers, the classic cheese and the classic beef for our, for our okay. go-tos, yeah. Ryan, I need to hear about the challenge known <laughs> as the Don. The Don. This is a funny story, actually. We um, we had a couple of guys that tagged us in a, in a post. A mate had tagged another mate saying, oh, have you been to the Beer and Burger Bar? And he goes, yeah, I have, but the burgers aren't that big. Ha ha ha. In a sort of joking way. One of my friends was doing our social media at the time and he goes, we just can't let them get away with this. Like we have to, you know, come back with something. He's like, what are we gonna do? So we put this burger together, took a couple of photos, posted it online, tagged the guys saying, hey boys, you wanted a big burger? Well, here's your big burger. I think we've probably had at least 13 people complete it out Is of it the thousand. Good? So there's a time limit, so it's 90 minutes. It's 75 bucks, 90 minutes um, to finish it. If you finish it, you get it for free. Then we up the ante and we said, okay, if you can finish it and beat the best time, you get 250 bucks prize money and you can come and you can custom make your own Don to share with your mates, which oh. a lot of people really wanted to do. All of this talk about your burgers is making me hungry. <laughs> can you please take us in the kitchen and show us how the beer and burger bar make their burgers? Done deal, let's go. Let's go. Okay. Let's take us in the kitchen at the Beer and Burger Bar. And we're gonna pass it over to Tita, our head chef, and she's gonna cook us our classic beef burger. We're in the kitchen. Tita's gonna show us how they do their burgers at the Beer and Burger Bar. Today, I'm gonna to make two signature burgers from Beer and Burger Bar, chicken burger and a beef burger. These are our hand pressed patty. Put on the grill. Ah, so your burgers are cooked on the grill tits and not on the yes. hot plate. Yeah, we just finish it off on the hot plate. Yeah. So around 80% on the grill, char grill, and then 10% okay. here on the hot plate, and then we melt the cheese on and this is actually, if you take a closer look, it's actually it's, the rocks and the planes. Yes, yeah. yes. It will give us a um, nice char core mark, so it um, gives flavor to it. And how much your patties weigh? 140 at the moment. Okay, and you have a custom Secrets. blend in-house secret? Yeah, well, we ask our um, our supplier what percentage of meat and patty do we need. Okay. And then they customize it for us. We got bacon on it. Okay. While we're waiting for that, I'm going to start making chicken burger. We use chicken breast and we use southern fried chicken. So 
some of my garnish. I'm going to pop in some chips as well. It's time for me to flip the beef patty. Take a look at that, it's real char grilled on the grill. So your fried chicken has onion rings as well? The onion ring is for the garnish on top, so when we okay. finish it off, we put onion ring on top of the burger. Uh, yep, yep. Yeah. It's like cherry on top. Okay. <laughs> I'll make the bun in the meantime. For that. So all our burgers um, go in milk bun, except the vegetarian and vegan. We have white buns for oh, yeah. vegan buns. Yeah. So both burgers have yeah. lettuce on the bottom? Yeah. Um, avocado for the chicken. We've got chipotle aioli for the chicken. And the burger sauce for the beef. In-house special in sauce? In-house, yeah. We made most of the sauces in-house. Yeah. Aioli from scratch. That's it, simple. The beef got bitrus relish. Relish. Relish, yeah, bitrus relish. And the cheese you use? Swiss cheese. Swiss cheese. Swiss cheese. Got bacon as well and Swiss cheese. While we're waiting for that, I'm gonna season the chips with chicken salt on it. This chicken salt very dangerous, very addictive. <laughs> <laughs> The cherry on top. The cherry on top. We've got the classic OG Plus, yeah. beef burger. We've got lettuce, tomato, beef patty, beetroot relish, bacon, Swiss cheese, and it's in milk bun. And fried and chicken? The fried chicken got lettuce, tomato, chipotle aioli, southern fried chicken, bacon, Swiss cheese, avocado, and in the milk bun as well. And to top it off, just like you said, Tita, the cherry is the onion ring on top. Yeah. Ryan, Tita, Thank you for letting Leo Smash Burgers pop in to the beer and burger bar. You are more than welcome. You're welcome. You're welcome. Pleasure. Time to eat. This is the classic beef. Mm. You can really taste the flame on that burger. Southern fried chicken. I'm speechless that that crunch on that chicken. Whoa. This is absolutely amazing. The onion ring, cherry on top. With warm, friendly and attentive staff, as well as a cozy environment, the BM Burger Bar is an ideal place to relax and enjoy a burger and a beverage. The big screens at the BM Burger Bar feature all the big sporting games. The BM Burger Bar has become not only a popular burger destination, but a popular destination for sports fans too. Additionally, the BM Burger Bar has a challenge to bring you to your knees. The Don 2.0 offers competitors the chance to battle in a gigantic 3.5 kilo in weight burger eating competition, complete with over 1400 grams of meat, 16 slices of bacon, 16 slices of cheese, and all the regular fillings and trimmings. You might need to train for this one. To accompany your burger, the bar offers a wide variety of beers, ciders from across the globe, as well as some of the best locally made brews. In total, 40 different options are available on the drinks menu with numerous beer burger specials on offer throughout the week located at 112 swan street it is only a two minute walk from richmond station and just two doors down from 70 tram stop the mouth watering burgers from the bm burger bar are a must for all of you food lovers tuning in to leon smash burgers pops in thanks for watching click and subscribe for the next episode in the meantime keep up the date on my social media for when leon smash burgers pops up until then, see you next time.